Today's To The Point topic comes from viewer uh, Ben TB4805, and it's in relation to setting the finish position. So when your job finishes, uh, the laser head sits on top of your job. Uh, some people like that because if you need to recut something or uh, engrave something over again, then it's sitting right there and it's in position and you can just run the job again or the portions that you want. Uh, but if you want the laser head to move out of your way, uh, there's a few ways to do that. Uh, in Lightburn, you have on the left here a uh, laser positioning tool. You can click that and then select anywhere you want uh, and click. And then you can go over to the right to the Move tab and set Finish Position. Now, if you don't have this tab, you can go up to Window and down to Move and be sure there's a check mark next to it. Uh, so you can also, other than the laser positioning tool, you can use the arrow keys on the move tab and just move your laser head around, jog it to where you want it, and then set finish position. In my case, home is 00, zero. it's in the top left corner. So if I want it to go there, I can just click the home button and then I can set finish position and home and finish will be one and the same. Uh, so we're going to run a test. We're going to take this circle. We're going to engrave it real quick. See where the laser head stops. We'll change that position. And then we'll run it again. Okay, let's do it. Okay, so now, laser head sitting right on top of the job. We don't want that, so we're going to send it home. Get it out of the way. Then we're going to, I may have to do it twice. Sometimes I do. Yep. So, we'll click uh, the laser positioning tool. We're just going to pick a spot over here. It'll take it to that position that's just off of the project. We can click Set Finish Position. Now we can send it back home. We can frame the job. We'll run the job again. And see where the laser goes. And the laser's out of the way, just as planned. So, uh, whichever uh, you prefer, you can leave it sitting on top of your job. So, you can run that again and, and be in line. Or you can move it out of the way with the laser positioning tool. With the arrow keys on the move tab. Or with the home button. And just remember to click set finish position. And you'll be good to go. I want to thank Ben TB4805 for this topic and idea. I really appreciate it. I hope it was helpful to everyone. And if anyone else has an idea or a topic suggestion, just let me know in the comments. And that wraps up today's To The Point Topic.